Yep. Hello. <sighs> Hello, welcome to the stream. Chair update. It broke again. <laughs> I cannot lay back anymore. Welcome to the bad posture channel. So. Titan Quest. Titan Quest got an update. A big one. An update that is a step in the right direction. They added... This guy. I'm just kidding. This guy was probably in here before, I just never noticed him. Or maybe he is new. That giant root plant... I like how it stops in midair to flip and then go into his hand. It's like, he's such a master. Anyways, big update dropped. And you might... You might notice... What changed here. <laughs> <laughs> and I was very happy about this update. A lot of the things that are balances and whatnot were for the uh, eternal embers, flaming embers, embers of fire, the third DLC. I don't really care about that. That doesn't really apply to me. I don't have that. But there were general changes. The most important and the most amazing a third tab in the character sheet or on the character sheet more details about numbers that apply to your character the, the game froze the game crashed <laughs> good start I can't believe this I can't believe you've done this <laughs> it just crashed I got so excited, the game just couldn't handle that. Alright, Steam synchronized. Now we can start it up again. That's okay. It crashed yesterday as well. Maybe the new update introduced something that makes your game crash? I don't know. What I know is... That for some reason OBS put the game capture to the bottom of the sources again. It only shows up because I have Before nothing else turned on right now. But... Entered the world, there was only... It's retarded OBS. I, I should really look up why it does that. Anyways, <laughs> hello, welcome to the stream. Playing Titan Quest again. Don't mind the previous 10 minutes. 7 minutes of those were just starting soon screen anyways because I... I had to go take a PP pee -pee and get some water and the game crashed. Again. Am I being trolled? I'm glad I didn't even start the background music yet because... <laughs> there might not be need for the background music if I can't play this shit. <laughs> if it just keeps crashing then... Well... You know... Eternal Embers, that's the name of the third DLC. Yeah. Well, fourth, but yeah. Immortal Throne is in the base game now, so, you know. Hooray. I like the Immortal Throne content. It's nice. Alright, the game just keeps crashing. Um, well, I guess there might be no stream. Or at least not this. If it just keeps crashing, I'll just play Grim Dawn. I mean, it's basically the same game. I wanted to be excited and tell you about the new third tab in the inventory screen, the character sheet extension. What if I launch the launcher and launch the game from the launcher? Enhanced. Let's wait for all these opening things to play. Ooh. Oh, that's loud. It's really loud. <laughs> Although, outside there's a goddamn lawnmower going, so... A 
At least it drowns out the lawnmower. You guys can't hear it. But I can. Even with a closed window. Before the light We're not waiting for this one. That's too long. It's a very long cutscene. And not a bad one, but yeah. Play Titan Quest? Epic? Single player? My bone charmer? I really hope this character didn't get corrupted. Because that would be... <laughs> that would be kind of sad. I mean, I could play Murder Fireman, but... Uh, I want to, to stab things now. Let's see. Hey, there we go. Hold on, I gotta close my fucking door. Because my cat opened the door. Because he can do that. He's a master of infiltration. Alright. And also my door is broken. <laughs> Everything is broken. Anyways, excitement. Please. Also, look at these items. I don't know where they came from. Probably from another character. I'll look at them in a second. This inventory is so small. Compared to Grimdon, holy shit. Anyways. It's like a couple rows smaller. Whatever. Third. Third thing. Let's just go into it. Look at this shit. Damage and duration bonuses. And I can see what type of percentage bonus you have for all the elements and damage types. And what multiplies it. So you know all the dexterity. Just like it says in the tooltip. Now you know what the actual number values are for dexterity multiplication or weapons, uh, weapon damage multiplier and spell multiplier. Because, you know, uh, like, uh, oops. For example, takedown is basically a spell, right? And it does bleed. So dexterity applies to takedowns, extra bleed and stuff like that, for example. Oh, wait, that's I'm stupid. I wanted pierce. Anyways, like, like, I guess Art of the Hunt? No, actually, that's... Although, take, yeah, takedown does piercing damage, so... Dexterity increases takedown's spell damage because it's a, it's a thing, so it, it makes sense. Bleeding does not get, uh, or, yeah, in... What? Yeah, spell multiplier. I, I'm, I don't know, I'm fumbling over my words. <laughs> I'm just too excited. Bleeding modification, poison, pet, ah! pet bonus. Oh my god! So you can enhance your pets with physical, elemental, and vitality. I did check this with my uh, summoner. It's pretty good. It works. Get your fire and burn, cold and frost burn, lightning and electrical burn, your vitality. Improved by intelligence only. And your life and energy leech amount, improvement to duration, and multiplier. That gets multiplied by lower level. At level 41, we get a 2.03. Interesting. So I guess 20 levels give you 1. Another 20 gives you 2 times multiplication. I don't know. Pretty good though. Monster and race bonuses. Look at these icons. These icons are pretty cool. You have a wheel. That's device. Constructs. Giants. Humankind. Humankind. Oh well. Demons. Magical. Ghosts. Undead. Insectoids. Plants. <laughs> Fucking plant. Beasts is a dove. It's kind of interesting. And Beast Man is a... Is that a deer or a minotaur? Probably a minotaur, but it looks like kind of like more deer-like. <laughs> I like the beast. It might not be a dove, and that might might be one of those carrion crows, but still, it's funny. Still, 
Nicely done. This thing, though, doesn't really tell me or say ghost in, uh, based on the picture alone. It's, it looks like the uh, mix of the, un the skull and the uh, bug. It's like that the spiders that come out of skulls, you know? Anyways, I, I like the devices. It's just fucking real. <laughs> this thing is the same. Also, I completely forgot, but I don't think chance to dodge attacks and avoid projectile and block chance was a stat before. I think you would just have to look at your shield and go into your skills and just memorize those kind of thing. things. Uh, I might look in the ward of earlier gameplay with this character to see, but I don't remember these stats. If they were here, I blanked on them. If they are new, hell yeah, they exist now, so I know. Look at the 47%! It's pretty cool. And also there is your life leech on weapon damage and uh, your weapons damage converted to elemental damage. Very nice. This is a step in the right direction. Maybe five years from now we're going to get more details. Because I still don't know the defensive bonuses of my pets. Or uh, my retaliation damage. I think that exists in this game as well. These are the same. Regen, casting movement. Oh yeah, I still don't know what the offensive and defensive abilities do percentage-wise. You see your you see your numbers. You see what the game what it's supposed to do. But there's still no way to tell the percentages, so that that is something that's still lacking, and these didn't really change. Combined armor is still here. I would like the uh, combined armor like pop-up window or this tooltip window that pops up, I guess pop-up eh? to have a second column, just like in Grim Dawn, where you can see the uh, actual absorption percentage. Because it is not 100% in this either, I think it's the same 70% like in Grim Dawn, because, I mean, Grim Dawn was ease running on the same engine as Titan Quest. So, you know, I mean, maybe they tweaked the numbers, maybe this is 80% or 60, I don't know, I read it somewhere in like a 2018 forum post or some shit, or maybe on the wiki, but I don't really remember anymore, so that would be nice. So, you know, more details could come, but honestly... This is nice. And this is nice. If, if it's new, I really don't remember. So yeah, good job. And that's why the stream is titled It's never too late to improve oneself. Because, what is this, a 16-year-old game? 26-year-old? I don't know. It's, it's an old game, right? Uh, and then still improving it, so... Applause! 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 Yes! Uh, <laughs> anyways, so epic difficulty, Brittany is back. Because I, that object just made me feel like I want to play this again, you know? Um, what's the speed? We are on very fast, yes. We are going to keep the very fast, because it feels good. I don't know about my items, so we'll look at that soon. I think W, so that's my curse everything. This is... Okay, so it's an active thing. Alright, so that's my poison resistance up by a certain amount, 54. And then my dude! Dude is aggressive. Oh, D is the quest thing here, okay, because it's Q in Grim Dawn. I should really make the key bindings for the bo the two games the same, because I have the like the quick bar, you know, W and then F here in Grim Dawn instead of R, because F is the uh, pet thing in Titan Quest that I really fucking love. So I made made it in <laughs> made it the quick slot key in the in the. Grim Dawn and just have the pet attack on it, you know, this. Go! 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 Okay, this is garbage. This is so much faster. But in Grim Dawn you only have the pet attack, you don't have a dedicated 
select everything and send them key uh, separately. So yeah. Is this the character that loses energy? Oh yeah, look at that. It's not. It I I can see it struggle slightly between four thirty five and four thirty six. Um. Three point sixty, so yeah. Yeah, now it's good because this eats two, and this eats another two. So I have point four in the negatives apparently, but game can't really handle that. That's all right. Um, what else? Oh yeah, items, and I, and I can start the background music. It looks like the game is not crashing now, so. Maybe it had to get it out of its system. And I'm going to listen to... That's right. It's the Windbound soundtrack. I haven't heard this in like a month, so I felt like listening to it again. It's amazing! I still love it. It's an hour, or 54 minutes. 40 seconds and after this it's gonna be just uh, back to the OG stuff like uh, the Titan Quest soundtrack and uh, Immortal Cities of the Nile or whatever the crack that is but the opening hour should be something beautiful so yeah um, now let's, let's look at the these weapons that I just have Phalian's Gale Spear Base damage looks better, piece ratio is worse, speed is better by X amount of percentage. Where is our attack speed again? Oh, there it is. Okay. So, the Chthonian Spike gives me a bunch of offensive ability, some cold damage, and a very abysmal low, abysmally low chance of double damage, physical only. Which is okay, because 30% of that should be also pierce. Converted to peers. Wait a minute, what is this? Oh, that's the new currency thing. Yeah, I don't think I will ever be able to get these. It might be for the DLC only. But we'll see. Yeah. It's, uh, what is this? Electrum? Some kind of material, I don't know. I don't know what to do with it. I kind of glossed over that part. But yeah, we, 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 we'll see. Um, also, this is loud. Which is not bad, but I can't hear myself, so I kind of have to lower it a little. I know it's better than me yapping about stuff, but I don't want to keep overshouting things. Then again, I could just turn it down on my end, but then I wouldn't shout, and then it would be very badly balanced audio. Although, most of the time it is, so, you know. And if it seems like I'm rambling too much, it's exactly right. I'm stressed. <clears throat> yes, uh, <laughs> for reasons. So I have a thunderbolt on it, which is more lightning damage and some cold damage. That's pretty cool. Nice bonus. But Phalian's Gale Spear gives percent gives a lot more lightning damage with its own percentages, so that's already Zeus's Thunderbolt check, and like three times better, more, a lot more than three times, what, it, what am I saying, it's 195, holy crap, it gives cold and lightning resistance, which I need, because I, I just started epic difficulty, I'm only in Megara, so it's the first like, two hours maybe, of this, Whatever. So, yeah, I need cold, I need lightning resin. Cold more than lightning. Lightning is actually not that bad. Still. It was Dex, offensive ability, a lot less, but still. Only 100 loss. And 26% attack speed, holy crap, and it gives thunderclap. This must be better. Even with the less pierce. Because of the sheer amount of extra lightning damage, it should be better. Look at that. 
that's like 110 average damage. And thanks to the extreme attack speed. Oh, yeah. You know what I would love to see? Actual goddamn target dummies added to, like, any any city that has a, a caravan driver should also have a target dummy. Maybe next to the teleport or close to the, uh, the, the stash person. Like, instead of this asshole juggling fruits and veggies, should be a target dummy or something, I don't know. That would be nice. Still. Thunderclap, what does that do? Thunderclap! Releases an electrical ring of energy that stuns enemies within its radius. Stuns! Every 8 seconds. <laughs> I will use that, probably. That's a good thing. I have a stun, right? Oh no, I don't. Because this is hunting and spirit, not uh, hunting and warfare or whatever. Warfare is the horn, this one doesn't. I don't know what I want to level up in skills, so that's gonna be a thing to remember. But, I got a better weapon. Storage <laughs> for the burden traveler! Ah, oh, it's, it's control right click. What the f <clears throat> It's usually shift in games. Like, oh, whatever. Bunch of guns I over leveled. A bunch of shells. It's also shield. At level 41, so this would be the next. Oh my god. Needs a lot of strain. I have that, but I have a feeling that it's because of. Oh yeah, the helmet. <laughs> yeah, I, I have to spend my attributes. No. That's a problem. Also, what is this? It's another Mibuti's ad, okay, but it's the epic version. That might be good. It's for sheer damage. Let's just put it in here. But keep it in here for now. Also, we gotta switch our colors. Excuse me, what? Safe travels! Wow! It's bleached. Oh, yes. Protean armor! Holy crap, that armor. So, a lot of cold resi. That's pretty much maxed cold. Maxed lightning, over maxed lightning, holy crap. Reduced, 119% reduced freeze duration. I don't even think you can have that. I think it caps at like 75 or 80, apparently. But still, that's pretty good. Extra block chance, and 15% chance of some retaliation. There you go, there is retaliation damage. Bunch of health, some energy regen percentage, and minus 9% recharge for like things that reach us, like this guy, this guy, this guy, you know. All the things that reach us. That's pretty good. But I would lose strength, <clears throat> defensive ability, by 10% of leech retaliation, and all that pierce and fire. So I would be very good with cold and lightning, but I would be absolutely in the negatives for pierce and fire. Although I would have a bunch of more armor. For my torso. Also, the hit percentages would be nice to be displayed as well. So, two columns for this combined armor, please. Percentage chance for body part hit and the uh, armor absorption percentages. It would be nice. Let's see what this does. So, without that extra strain, I can't actually use this. Wait, I get five points? I get four here, okay, so I probably have... Oh, it's because of the uh, percentage bonus from the uh, helmet. That helmet is probably going to stay there throughout the entire rest of the game. Minus 10, minus 12. But these boys are max, so it doesn't stay uh, say what the uh, overcap percentage is. Because I have more than 80% resi for lightning now. Don't say any. That would also be nice to see. 
My torso is 424 from from absolute garbage. I think I'll have to do this and suffer with fire and pierce, inst uh, but have the extra extra armor. Although pierce goes through armor, so. Uh, You know what, it's change. The damage doesn't change. Actually, the damage per second changes. It goes down. Oh, because the retaliation is larger. Okay. Defensive ability. 816! Goes down to 691. Oh, that's bad. I might keep the uh, the shitty the shitty clothing. That's a lot of defensive ability lost. I'll I'll, I'll see how it performs. I can hold that for you. Yes, you can. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's adorable. It's. it's Scarab beetle wings or something. Anyways, these are early level things. These are stuff I don't care about. I don't think I'll ever wear this helmet, but it's there. It is. And now I also have the crystalline breezers. Ah. I lose cold, frostburn, lightning damage. Oh wait, this deals a lot of lightning. But this actually works with it. Oof. Strength again, dex, attack speed loss. Yeah, I might not change this out. But I get... Again, lightning resistance, I don't care about that. Cold damage, some attack speed, yeah, this is not gonna be better. I lose strength for one. I lose damage. Yeah. Good day. Your goods are safe with me. All right, we can actually start going. Everyone's talking about the yes. Hold the loose. The three princes each oh, wait, master one form of warcraft. The lower. Polypus bore sword and shield. Minon rained deadly arrows on their foes. And Aristeus worked magic of ice and lightning with Kill a staff me. in his hand. I don't remember when I started to actually listen to the lore, I think from Delphi onwards. So until Delphi we still have to listen to these. For reasons. And then I can start skipping them again. Finally. Muse, grant me voice. <clears throat> voice and memory to tell about the first of wars. The oldest battle in the times before the gods had come to rule, when they were bowed beneath the heavy titan hand. The ill-formed titans, great in strength and cruelty, oppressed the gods, their offspring. Until at last, behind the leadership of lightning-wielding Zeus, the gods took arms against the titan kings. It was the first war, and the greatest. Oceans were moved, and the mountains overturned. Gods and titans struggled for dominion. Might and cunning making victors first of one and then another. Until at last, wearied in their age, the titans lost the war. The gods threw down their foes beneath the earth into the pit of Tartarus. Except for one, the strongest and cruelest of the titans. And he they chained beneath a mountain for revenge. Then Zeus was king of gods and ruler over all the world. The first gods, daughters and sons of the titan Kronos, are Zeus, Hera, Demeter, Poseidon, and Hades. They rule the sky, the earth, the sea, and the underworld, where the dead come to dwell. The first gods, Daughters and the first god, the first gods, dot. By the looks of you, traveler, your feet are sure and firm on land. Well, mine are just as sure aboard a seabound vessel. Are you flexing on me? 
Yo, fisherman. You impudent fisherman. Oh, hold on. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's getting too hot for a back pillow now. Even though it was very good for my posture. I hate when my back sweats. And it does if that pillow is there, because goddamn summer arrived. And I fucking hate it. No, oh, there's bigger boats that come here. Soldiers and traders from the corners of the earth. But before them, my grandfather's father sailed fishing boats in Megara. Cool. Fishermen. That is my trade, that is my life. It's dangerous these days. Sirens, stupefying sailors. And now, according to that fellow, Kraken beasts big enough to eat a ship. Think of it! They are going to confirm the Kraken in the uh, Immortal Throne beginning in Rhodes. Where they squished Kraken with the statue. On accident. Well, at first <laughs> when the monster showed up, I didn't worry. Take to the sea, I thought. Uh, but there are strange beasts in the water too. Nowhere is safe. Yeah, these fish, huh? Nasty. We're out on the water <laughs> long before rosy fingered dawn. A good day, we're back in time to sell our catch. Well, safe travels a land. Well, well, safe travel. Well, well. Why these monsters came or what they want? Eh, nobody knows. Eh. I have heard news from almost <laughs> every city state in Greece. Beasts everywhere. Eh. Houses burning. Is there any hope left? Magara will hold out. We have warriors. We can fish if we can't farm. Beyond the walls, I've heard rumors of bigger beasts, cyclops. Would the walls of Magara hold out against one of those? Attack on Titan. What am I really <clears throat> afraid of? I'll tell you. I'm afraid I'll survive when these monsters have had their way with Greece and raise my family hiding in caves or cowering deep in the woods. Magara has always been my home. I will stay here, come what may. Tiny home you have. Magara has always been my home. Shingeki no something something. Titan. I don't know. You there! Alright, so I stab. Wait, what is the auto pickup? I think it's A, right? Oh, I, I want to see if they fixed it or not. It wasn't in the update thing, but you know, there's a random dude with another random dude. And they're just kind of closed in there. Maybe they have a door or something. Ah! Look at that! They got. Sp sp I can't move. There we go! Holy crap! Okay, A does work. Whoa! Axe of Lesbos. Oh yeah, they added Gundam sound effects when something shiny drops. Like unique sound effects. I took that from Path of Exile, probably. <laughs> Sentinel League is boring, by the way. And at least it looks absolutely... Just... It's like playing standard, but with a little bonus to your drop rates and shit. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> uh, interesting. That looks kinda cool. That's a bearded axe if I ever seen one. Its beard is so long you have to cut off the uh, handle. <laughs> what if it grows all around? It becomes a goddamn shield. It's a living axe. Looks cool though. Wait, can I get better health potions? Oh no, these are the better ones. Oh, it's dropping worse ones. Okay, good. Done. So this character just runs at things and stabs them, apparently. So honestly, I will really rely on health leech. And I have none. <laughs> oh, that sucks. Okay, healing is cute. Put that on myself again. Uh, at least I can stun things if I feel like I'm in danger. That is pretty good. I can just do a thunderclap. 
in my thighs. On the thighs. So how do I display? Because money disappeared. Wait, I can't. Is there? Oh no, that's its head. Okay. <laughs> Wait, drop this. There we go. Oh, it's Alt. If I press Alt, it disappears. If I press it again, Jesus. Gotta turn that music up. There's no other way. I keep pressing all the time. It's gonna piss me off. Cause in in Grimdown, I press Alt when I move, so I don't accidentally attack things. With, with a ranged character. But this is a melee character anyway, so I shouldn't press Alt anyways. But I keep doing it, so I, again, I don't know if it's turned on or not. It's turned on again. Spiders. God damn, I almost pressed Alt again. No. I've been playing Grim Dawn. At least, look at that. Look at that health potion regen time. Or recharge time. It's so fast. In Grimdon you have to wait twice as much. I guess here I can just chug. I don't need to have life leech. Thunderclap! That's right. Something cool dropped and I can't see it. I heard it. I heard a shiny. I heard a trinket drop or a ring or something. Maybe it's jumping or something and thus not appearing. Wait, how did I press 2? I legit pressed W. Oh my god. I did an overreach. Again. It's something nice dropped and I can't see it. And it's none of these. What the hell? made the noise. There it is. Oh, because it's for the DLC! I'm on epic difficulty, not even on goddamn legendary. Shouldn't drop this. Fucking hate this game, dude. The legendary DLC knife. So good. Oops. Crap, it's so delayed. What's my casting speed? Oh, yeah, 
that's, that's why. Oh, because the character needs to move? What? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, they move to where I click when I do thundercrab. So they just the character doesn't just do it. I have to shift thundercrab. Okay. Good to know. Thundercrab. And fucker ran out of it. What an asshole, man. How can they do this to me? Was that rat in the sepulcher? It looked like it came out of it. Maybe it was glitched behind it or something? I don't know. Thunderclap! These birds are annoying. Uh, now I'm pressing D instead of Q because... Or not the A. I'm pressing A because A is the health potion in Grimdown, but A is the auto pick up here. Oh my god, everything is around. I need to press Q and E. Q and E! Oh, this, this first hour is gonna be suffering. And the first hour is almost up. Holy crap, it took me over half an hour to actually start running around. It's alright. Can I curse statues or these things? No, I can't. Good. Oh god, I got stunned. How about you get stunned? <laughs> Every time I open the inventory, I see the zero, and I'm like, where's my money? <laughs> it's to the side. Because ah. I think that new currency thing is for certain crafting or transmuting or something, but that kind of stuff is not in the base game, so... I don't think I'll ever pick up that type of stuff. Forever gonna be a big ass zero. All oh, the princes are dead. Poor guy! Got jabated hard. The guy teleported behind him because I got too far. It's amazing. down to the beach here? Oh no, we can't. It looked like on the map. I thought they added some kind of new secret. Finding path that leads you down to the beach here. A little secluded beach with a giant turtle monster or something. Or a squid. But no. What is that though? Oh yeah, they also added on map icons for things, so Laden's Maw is what dropped, and I, I don't have the rights to pick it up, so. <laughs> it's gonna just die there. I hope it's a very good item. <laughs> Look! Laden's Maw, everybody! 0.0001% chance to drop. Yeah! 
You can win the game with that item alone. But I can't pick it up. Oh, one v one, you come here. Oh. Damn, I'm strong. Also, this W helps a lot. Study prey is pretty good. Also, they, I think they did some kind of skill balancing, or, or people just wanted them to do skill balancing, or asked if there is any skill balancing. So, actually, I don't know if they did or not. Gives me almost 50% extra damage, and next level is gonna be the 50% extra damage, so that's gonna be very good. I could also... I could have popped Call of the Hunt, but... Yeah, because of this, holy crap, exploit weakness, yeah, that's the big one. Yeah. Stacking bonuses, woo! Wait, nothing is good here? Then what the hell drops? Oh, Zealous. Where is it the filter? X, Y, Control, Control. Ah, Control! Yeah, because I want to pick up the rings and such. Because they don't take up a lot of slot and I can sell them for money. There we go, control, not alt. Okay. Alt is the one that's like whatever. see the stun animation of all the enemies. Yes. I actually want that. Because I like to see them. I like to see what kind of unique animations they have for enemies. And they are stunned! Oh no! They hang their head low. Or they fall asleep for a split second. What about the turtles? Oh, they do the same. I like the skeleton stun when they go they bend backwards or something. <laughs> Those are fun. Yeah. Yes, walking to my stab. I'm definitely doing that, so that's a good one. If I had life leech, I would use that. So that would be nice. If I had like 10% life leech with the weapons, this would help. But I don't have it, so I don't care. I think I wanted to put one point into these two. I would have an extra 10% speed for 10 seconds. It's some extra damage. Eh. That's probably gonna go for legendary difficulty. Oosh. I come to stab. like this stun. CC is important.
No, but friendship. Amazing. just max out the movement speed. I need more. <laughs> but I could just go into uh, <clears throat> speed hack mode. Where I just put an extra 30% or 70% speed onto the game. Yeah. I can wrap this entire difficulty setting up in like two hours. And mind you, it wouldn't just be the player character that gets faster. Everything will get faster, so... That's how you train your ref reflexes. Plus, it would be nice to see more shield-related stuff. Shield recharge duration, you know? It would be nice. Wait, does the shield give me the... Oh, the shield gives me the 20% block projectiles. Or avoid them. So you don't you don't just hold up your shield, you hold up your shield and since it's so polished and shiny, archers are like, oh god, I can't see! And and you can dodge because they just miss, you know. The rest comes from here, right? Yeah. This might be something I level up. Because in Immortal Throne, those cause those goddamn Makai archers are uh Oh boy, I hate those, so <laughs> Maybe more projectile avoidance would be nice. But I mean, Immortal Throne is far away. I'm gonna have at least five more levels by then, so. Biden, huh? <laughs> There's a meme from America. Because <laughs> that man is just a meme. Oh, poor America. I mean, they chose him. Or did they? Dun dun dun. Thunderclap! Archers can't run away if they are stunned. Yeah! Next level strats. You've seen it here first. World's first. Kill that thing! Thousand crit. Nice. Now this is where the problems start to happen. I have negative pierce resistances. And they are all just throwing shit at me. My energy! What am I doing? Shouldn't this be some kind of different attack? Do I not have a weapon augmentation? A virile lens. Ooh. Ok, 
Okay. Is it time for the bow quest soon? Oh boy. It's this song. I hate that. I didn't need that in my life. <laughs> Fucking sound effect. <laughs> oh, eh. But I guess it exists, so. <laughs> A my bow! Greetings, good traveler. Uh, you, you need to shut up. You see, I am... No lore! I'm not a summoner, but what the hell? There we go. Ladies and gentlemen, we got... <laughs> nah, no, I'm still gonna go through, I just like doing that. Did it. My bow. My bow. Yup. Stun boars. They got basically lightly microwaves. Big boar pelts, oh my god. I'm stabbing the air. Your damage is useless now. I just need to reapply my ointments for my resistances. That's a good reason to use spears in this game. The weapon range. You know, if you were using goddamn daggers or 
short swords or some garbage like that. Like, come on. I know I listen to the lore of these guys, so I'm not gonna do that now. A blacksmith up. Shut up! I was on my way. I was on my way to a vacation. Then I died. I see you've traveled a long road, stranger. Come, have a look. I might have something to suit your needs. Thank you. I don't even care about those rings. Better, worse, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter at all. Yeah. All that matters is exploit weakness that I don't even use. Outriders Buckler. Buckler. I don't know why I say it like that, but but I do. I do say it like that, and it will never change. It's a buckler. God damn! I hate when they run away. Just stop. Accept your punishment for being an evildoer. So what does this do? Garbage. That is my grove burning on the hill. Holy crap, two majestic chests, is that intended? No one knows, no one will ever know, but I think only one of them actually dropped stuff. <laughs> she got destroyed, just piled on my buffs and bonuses <laughs> and the debuff and boom, she died.
think I resummoned my guy again instead of pressing W. I don't know how I reach up that high, but it's kind of annoying. Actually, I think I know why. Because my my middle finger is resting on W. And when I want to press like, skills and stuff, it's usually in the number keys, right? And, and I have that in me, that I have to reach higher. And I just need to press W. It's as simple as that. Maybe I should go back to playing Path of Exile too. I have to click... Um, like letters instead of numbers on the keyboard skills and stuff recondition myself back to the good old days Fuck. half the time I'm stabbing the air and they just run into it Is here. And I pressed the wrong thing again. Oh my god, what am I doing? Okay, it's dead. I've been pressing everything. Okay, so D, which is the energy potion in goddamn Grimdawn, is the quest window in here. They tried to chug energy potion, but it's opened it. Hey, oh, I need to go back to get the skeleton raiders. So the skeletons will trouble us no more? You have done a great service to- You have put an end to a great evil. In future times, children will play in those ruins, and shepherds will tend their sheep there. Why didn't you either rebuild the goddamn ruins, or, or salvage useful building material from the ruins instead of just leaving them there so they deteriorate and just- Oh, a ruins, it's cultural value. I don't care! Fuck, it's so stupid. Why do people do that? Sword and shield, not your style? I think you'll find what you're looking for here. Look at those beautiful ruins. My pleasure. Suck my dick. Greetings! What's the level on this? 28? Hey, it's not even the epic version, it's just the normal one. Ugh. Can I put these in there again? What is this? Lionheart. Your goods are safe with me. I'm in control. <laughs> I should play control someday. I have it. Although, when I watched the playthrough of it, I didn't find it that interesting. But I guess the SCPs are pretty fun. Uh -huh. Maybe one way. That's not what I want. 
have it, had it on randomized. So. We're going to the Children of Nile. The immortal CDs. That's what I want. Yeah. Egypt. Best. Don't get many visitors. Greetings. How can I help you? Wonder why. Hey. Health stacker. <laughs> That's nothing. Necromancer. Ooh, what's this? Raises a force of flame in enchanted skeletal warriors to do the caster's bidding. Ooh, that. That's pretty cool. I'm buying that. To see what it does. They don't really have a... Wait, they have... Oh, Fire Enchanted. Okay, so they do physical damage and then some burn. Interesting. Earthquake, Breaking Wheel, and Vengeance is mine. Goodbye now! Wait, 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 wait. Greetings! Colors. So I have this for Immortal Throne and then four more. We have the white now. I have let's buy this light blue. I think that's what I had before I switched to this now, but by the ugly red as well. You know, that's my idea. Safe travels! Yes, Mr. Wait, 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 wait. What kind of Welcome. health potions do you have? Grand? Yeah, that's not nearly good enough. I already drank the larger ones. God damn. I... Grand. Keep blocking my crits. Oh my god. Okay, so Thunderclap has a little delay between the actual Thunderclap visual effect and the the stun happening. Yeah. Kinda sucks, but okay. See? But he still gets stunned. Even though he ran through it, so it's kinda weird. Something hurt big. Oh, I got dispelled. How dare you? Come back here. Oh god. Is it you? Someone did those things to me. Staff of the Magi. This was the guy, huh? Probably. Maybe. I don't know. This is pretty cool. Minus 16% recharge. Burn. Fire. Mmm. Murder fire man might like this. I'll put it away for it. Get out of there. Wait a wait a minute. See what I see? This used to be a little area where the, the goat men come down to to drink and stuff, but there 
Is this new? Have I never seen this? Have I never realized that this was there? What is this? There's nothing here. Just this very ugly <laughs> stretched texture at the edge of the uh, the land when it just goes down. It, this 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 requires another stone to cover it up. <laughs> Is there like a door somewhere? Is this for a DLC I don't have? Or maybe on Legendary Difficulty something is here. Mm. It feels like it's new, I've never seen this. Okay, so there is nothing behind this. Interesting, yes. Oh my god. Already better than the updated version of uh, <coughs> Reign of Terror <coughs> that broke my necromancer. <coughs> <laughs> but I will not talk about that. I won't talk about that when I, when I go back and play that. It's enough to say that they fixed things that needed to be fixed. And it sucks. Absolutely destroyed. I don't know why the game is doing these chuggings, but scares me. It scares me especially since... Okay, the fan is still working. Had a little trouble with my laptop on the weekend. <laughs> Wait, what day is it? It's not Monday anymore. Monday was the day when it was disassembled. My poor thing. I had to, I had to disassemble him or her. I don't know what laptops are considered as. You know, because like boats are her. The like, boats are female. Planes, I think. I don't know. What what is a laptop? What is the gender of a laptop? Because I had to take take it apart. Did a extremely thorough cleaning. I found a uh, cooked, possibly over a year old uh, uh, <laughs> uh, what is that? Cranberry? In the back, next to the uh, next to the uh, speakers, <laughs> it was just back there. <laughs> it didn't impact the performance at all. It was just literally 
behind the uh, the screen between the, uh, between the screen and the speakers I guess I don't know how it got there I didn't I didn't ever throw cranberries at my laptop so I don't know how it went over the the the, the screen or display and <laughs> get back there but it was there it's not there anymore. And surprisingly, it didn't have a lot of dust inside. Like, I was full on ready for, like, thick dust plus cat hair layers everywhere, but it was, it was less dusty than, I don't know, my, my, the far side of my desk that I never clean because it's like, there's nothing important near that, so it just collects dust at one corner of my desk. <laughs> but the CPU fan started acting up and, uh, and I thought it it would be bearing the shoes, you know, when the uh, lubrication dries up and shit like that. Because it made the most horrifying noises. So it was taken apart by me, and uh, I successfully dis disassembled it without breaking anything, and then put it back together without breaking anything. And man, let me tell you, reconnecting the goddamn cables for the keyboard... I have kind of... I mean, it's uh, proportional, but kind of like short and stubby fingers like reaching in there holy fuck <laughs> and i'm not good with pliers so yeah i tried <laughs> but it turned out to be finger time so i fingered my laptop and hey it works and since like about 20, 22 hours ago, the noise is stopped from the fan and it works properly and I even have some utility tools for fan control and I sp spun it up to 100% and it was fine, so I don't know what was the problem, but hopefully it's out of the system now, so yeah. Is this an old model and finding a goddamn replacement fan for it? Uh... Yeah, it, it, it wasn't easy, but apparently they exist, but hopefully I won't need them yet. Hey, it's a teaser. Is that it again? Another character or just continuing with another from uh, before? Ah, uh, it's it's the uh, Bone Charmer from before in on Epic Difficulty. I, I felt like playing again because they added an extra character sheet tab and gave some, some more information about what your character is doing, what they are about, what kind of bonuses you have and stuff like that. Still not enough bon uh, information on the character sheet compared to Grimdawn, for example, but it's a good update, so you know, I, I felt like playing again. So I'm continuing the uh, Bone Charmer with the uh, just run at them and stab them. Plus, you have the Lich King, that's basically the build. <laughs> when the first satyrs attacked Delphi, my husband... Right. From Delphi onwards, I'm gonna skip the lower stuff, because I know I listen to possibly most of them. Alright, what kind of bonus am I gonna get now? I really need some Pierce resin. Seeker, we the great oracle of Delphi poison. sits within. 7% per permanent poison resistance. I don't need that. That's the only thing I don't need. I think on normal difficulty I got fire for this character, but I don't remember. Oh well, poison resistance. At least I don't have to level up my herbal remedy for a while. So those two points can be saved for something else, I guess. Still. Welcome. Screw you. You. Screw you. Apollo guide you. Apollo guide you. I don't need Apollo. Be as the mouse. Set aside provisions. That's Hessian. That's Hessian. Profane centaur curious. 
that's curious. Apollo smile on you. Sure. Sure, buddy. Where's the the shop? Blades, there? shields, potions, greaves, bows, helmets of all kinds. Oh, uh, can I help you? Can I? Help you? Ooh, that looks cool. It's so tiny! I, I want the tower shield! Ugh. I want the big boy shield. Got a goddamn Trigonus. Bye then! Ugh, haven't been playing games for a long time now. Last time was Rome Total War 2, but somehow watching games is often more fun than doing it yourself. Hey, I'm an enjoyer of... Uh, well, I was an enjoyer of Let's Plays when Let's Plays were a thing, so... I understand, I understand. Like, there are a lot of games that I just watched the full play through, either stream or, or Let's Play or whatever, and never played the game myself, so... You know. Just kind of find the type of person who plays games the way you would play them, you know? Or, or anything that's entertaining enough. But yeah. Oh. Plus, you don't have to uh, dedicate time to learn the uh, game mechanics. You just sit down and watch it. And, yeah. It's good fun. Thankfully, Grim uh, Grimdon. Goddamn. Oh, <laughs> Titan Quest. It's not that complicated, so I can use it as a time sink, I guess. Also, there was a new, a new path uh, right here. Yeah. So this is the little goat camp that has a little beach. Actually, is that it? Yes. It has a little beach down here. Wait. Yes. And this used to be like a dead end, but now you can go to the other side. And there's a waterfall and stuff like that. And that looks pretty cool. I don't think that's been there before. But there was nothing on the other side, so I'm, I'm guessing on Legendary Difficulty there might be something. Or maybe I need one of the DLCs. There are things that are different, and that's pretty cool. And I have Thunderclap. With the delayed stun. God damn it, the press two again. <laughs> Ooh, Scimitar of the Hawk. Not bad. Get yourself a, I don't know, Warfare, Rogue, and the dual wield, those kind of things, and just go hack some shit up. Does it even have pierce ratio? 10%. <laughs> garbage. still kind of confused whenever I'm trying to press some kind of hotkey because I'm like is this the right hotkey am I going to accidentally open up the uh, the quest window again <laughs> oh, 
That's the problem when you play a game where it's very similar, but you have your key bindings set up differently. The brain is not as fast as it used to be. <laughs> The way for I think this is the way forward indicated by the torches. But let's not go there. Because going forward means death. Certain death. But I guess that's the only way. Honestly, this doesn't feel like an epic difficulty. It feels like playing normal. Just with a lot worse resistances for certain things. Again, again Pierce is leading the the group with the lowest <laughs> lowest percentage. God damn Pierce resistance. I guess at least piercing attacks can be blocked, right? Unless they are spells. Can spells be blocked with normal block? Who even knows? This game is full of mysteries. I also added uh, map markers for uh, legendary items that draw. Which is nice. The first legendary item that dropped I couldn't pick up because it's DSC. <laughs> but I could see its name on the map. So that sucks. Gently reminding me that I still have parts I need to pay for. <laughs> but I don't wanna. Level up, go! Yes. Sweet, sweet, level up. Yes. <laughs> Maxing out something I barely use. God bless respec options, if I ever need them. Ah! Oh! Something unique dropped. I think it's the same goddamn item, yeah. That's the thing that dropped. Landon's Maw. <laughs> That's the second one. God. <laughs> Maybe I need to refresh the uh, the drop table. Maybe I need to quit for a second. <laughs> I can't pick that up. I don't have the right. Well, that's absolute ass. Overbuff myself for a lava bat, and it dies before I can even finish buffing. Got them Lendons Ma. Oh, he fell. Or she. 
Yes! Yes! Oh, I didn't fall down. What are you playing with these dogs for? They're dirty. Infernal dogs. At 1.5 seconds doesn't last long because of the sped up. I mean, it, it feels kind of useless. But I guess I can stun enemies out of certain actions, maybe. Maybe. It's kind of hard to time it, though, because the visual effect happens before the actual stun effect. Eh. STUN! That was some spooky song right there. Ooh. Let's go back to Delphi and cash in a quest. We avenged the corpse man. So... So let's get some money. MONEY! I dreamt of my husband again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't need to know about your masturbation. What is this thing? Party Aspis. <laughs> Aspis. Ha! <laughs> uh, <laughs> I love that word. <laughs> Strain stacking Aspis. Oh. Hmm. Oh, it's actually lower than the other one because 26 is better than the 8%. That sucks. What else did I get? A bunch of garbage rings. Shields! Grief! Buy the whole come again! Buy the whole come again? Stores deep and wide, as the poets say. Safe journey. Jingle bells, jingle bells. <laughs> oh man. Rome Total War 2. That's another old game. All these old games, but. People keep going back to them because, I guess, part, partly nostalgia, and partly because they're just better. <laughs> whatever is provided nowadays. Most games are full of scammy shit. Absolute disrespect of the player's time. Again, something dropped. There it goes. The thing keeps turning off. Or maybe I pressed Alt or Control unknowingly. It could be a thing. Oh my god. I was just about to press the health potion and I looked up to my health level and just at that moment the goddamn sound played. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna let my herbal remedy run out. I wanna see what my uh, poison resistance is without it. Since the game refuses to tell me if I have any over cap resistances. So it might be on 80, it might be more than 80, so I have to wait. I have to wait. Because if I just, you know, look at this, oh, 54% and I have 80 now, so it's probably like 26 or something. But it's probably more than that. Let's see. 
It is 26. Are you fucking kidding me? I was on 80. Okay, good. So it still matters. Okay. But my lightning is definitely more than 80%. Because I have a bunch of shit. Okay, see, even without the goddamn spear that gives 37%, I'm still on 80. So, who knows? I have a lot of lightning resistance. Okay, the cave is a dead end cave, right? Yeah, let's go in there. Hello! Fish! I'm here to take your body parts as hostages. Ah! Toxic man catcher. Can you call a toxic man catcher a trap? Another aspis. <laughs> Another one. I think I have some energy leech. And I can actually check that uh, right here. 5% life and energy leech. Wait, extra 5% plus the global multiplier, but what's my base leech? Because I don't have weapon damage, just health. Oh my god, this also gives lightning resistance, lightning resistance, lightning resistance, lightning resistance. 70% of this only. Crap. Lightning resistance again. <laughs> oh, this is a very good medallion. Yeah. Total damage and more attack damage converted to health. That's good for my ledge. Good for me as well. Lightning resistance and cold. <laughs> no wonder these are maxed out. Fire. 7% chance of a lot of damage reflected. That's pretty cool. Where is my energy leech? Because I did see the, the blue little sparkle coming out of the spider as I stabbed it. And that's the energy leech thing, right? Oh well. Doesn't really matter. I don't use a lot of energy. And basic attack, Andy. I don't have an attack modifier. Leave me alone, what is this? Thunderclap. Lady. Why you gotta dispel me? Unfair. That's a tradition. Health and thingy. Garbage health potion. Whatever the hell that is. Says, gar says garbage too. Another necromancer scroll. Strain stacking gauntlet. Ooh. <laughs> oh no. I have to stomp. It's also garbage aside from the extra percentage strength and health. But I think I have better stack gauntlets already.
How peaceful. I like how they can still block when they are stunned. I imagine that's just the character accidentally hitting the shield. While they are trying to furiously stab the enemy. Ah! <laughs> Total berserk. <gasps> Warden's helmet. Finally, something I can pick up. <laughs> I already have that. Doesn't even matter. It's trash. Yeah, it's for shamans. I mean, uh... Nature. Yeah. Saw Maul, I was like... That's the shaman skill from Grimdon, isn't it? But I don't think it actually is. Just reminded me of shamans. One of my least favorite uh, classes in Grim Dawn, shaman. It's just. It's so boring. <laughs> but I might do a shaman build. And it's probably not going to be the Grim Dawn one, it might be the Reign of Terror one. With Tornado. There's a reason behind it. Sad, sad reason. Definitely doing energy leech. Because I can see their energies going down. My hat is about to die. By some nasty archers. They can't life leech bones. Hopefully summoning things doesn't use up any resources really. It uses up one potion and that's it. No need for like a summoning ritual or, or a summoning scroll or something. It would be kind of cool if you had a mechanic like that. You can set up a ritual to summon something and the more ritualistic items you have, the stronger your summon will be. Another staff of the magi. Your summons would be a lot more crucial to the gameplay. Oh, there's loop.
need like another 40% casting speed, I feel. So slow to do the uh, thunderclap. I don't got the time to wait for that. I keep cancelling the animation. God, he's naked now. Don't look. Poor civilized little gold man. Turn naked, naked. Frozen? How dare you! but different a different kind of monster I hate these throwing weapon assholes why do they even keep the throwing weapons? Although, then again, where do you keep your arrows? But get out of here. This game needs a quiver slot. Actually, it already has a quiver slot. This game needs a quiver. And if you had an arrow, a bow, you would have a quiver for arrows. And if you had like throwing knives, you know, you would. You would. I guess. I guess you can. You can dual wield throwing knives, right? And other throwing weapons, so maybe you could choose like slower attack speed if you do wield them because you don't have a, a knife satchel or something, or faster attack speed because you have like a, a weapon in one hand and in your off hand it's the uh, the bag for the rest of the weapons. I hate how these skeletons just come up to me and start throwing daggers. It's like, what the hell? Just come closer and try to stab me instead. So I don't have to run towards you all the time. Look at this asshole, he's throwing axes at me. Or, yeah. Bitch, get out of here.
guess that's one use for the overtime damages. You stab a rat archer, they run away and then they bleed to death. Maybe I should increase my bleed. Can't hurt me with cold. I am dead inside. Always have been. Plus, I have eighty percent cold resistance. Haha, <laughs> it's the main reason. <laughs> Throwing axes, however, hurts. No, please don't. Ah, oh, God. How did I block that while running away? Well, don't crash, no! Fuck! <laughs> it crashed. <laughs> so sad. Before the light of the. Shut up. How much did I lose progress wise? I'm just gonna run past everything, I don't care. Oh, it's the wrong difficulty. At least the drop table resets, right? No more Laden's Maw or whatever. Hello? Oh my god, it crashed again. What? I think this update may have introduced some instabilities. Before the light. Before the light, there was no light. Was there darkness? We don't know. Epic. Nice. Oh, not him. Why do you buff him? He doesn't care about poison damage. Look at him. His bones. Buff yourself. There you go. Okay, stop playing with those. We don't care about them. Okay, so I lost the entire... this part. So basically I lost everything from the... Uh... But not the items. Or maybe the items too. That's why you you have your manual save, I guess. I don't know. Oh, some blue drops. The seat on the minimap. It's actually a pretty decent uh, addition to the game as well. You don't have to be like, where is it? Because you can just see it on the minimap. Or the large map. It's Memnon, Memnon's signet. Is it Agamemnon? Who knows? The good news is I can pick it up. 
I am allowed to touch. Hmm. Ooh, it's a full-on set item. A set item that uses shields. Guard, Aegis, Signet, and Trust. Fierce resistance, health, health regen, offensive ability, and attack speed. Close, but not close enough. So I'm not gonna use that. The offensive ability, I, I like that, but. I lose damage. Dexterity, I wouldn't gain a lot of attack speed, I would lose poison resistance. I would lose the skill bonus, but I don't really care about that right now. But I do care about that pierce resistance and the uh, dex and pierce damage. So, Ring of the Shang, both of them stay. Let's not even do anything here. Let's skip this part. Because I think the experience also stayed. It's only the map uncoverage, the fog of war, that reverted back. At least that's what it looks like to me. Want to get out of this undead zone because I really hate these throwing boys. We already have a bunch of archers, they don't need throwing boys. Stop playing with that guy, come on, let's go. An insulted loop! Poison? How dare you. I could have waited with the crash until I killed the uh, Gorgons, you know, and then crash before I get the next re revive fountain or rebirth fountain, so I get to fight the Gorgons again. Easy. Stop it. They did a valiant effort throwing those cluster poison grenades or whatever, but I just stood in the middle and didn't get hit <laughs> by any of the fragments as a glaring flaw in their strategy. That's alright, they are rats. So it's okay to be uh, racist against them, right? The rat people. They're not humans. And this thing is loud. And of course when I go to uh, quiet it, it ends. Come to fight again, Gorgon. That's same strat as every time. Kill! Pull that bitch in. Pull her. Pull her ass. Pull that ass. Yes. Pull that ass all the way in here. 
on the way. Pull that ass. I'll be killing. Bitch! Oh no, she alerted the rest of the squad. That's okay, I'm absolutely monstrous with my damage. You! Stiletto! You die too. Give me your crown. Nope. I can't take it off her corpse. I see it on her head, but nope. I guess Stiletto's crown stays. That's a shit. Not a DLC item dropped. Wow. Look at that blue shield. It's Saint Mo Saint Mother's Revs. That sounds like some kind of Ragnarok bullshit. Thanks, game. It's those things. It's not even the shield, it's this garbage looking shit. I can't believe I can't believe I let those gorgons get the better. Thank you, but goodbye. Thank you, good goodbye. Da -da -da. <laughs> A disgusting display of monstrous power. I kind of have to though, because melee character running up to the danger zone. Yeah, gotta be disgustingly strong, otherwise you die before you get anywhere. My defenses are kind of low. Which is not good, but I really don't want to sacrifice uh, damage output for defense. Oh, Titan Crest began. Are we in the last hour? Oh, we are. Hello! Look at all my rings. Amulets that are also probably garbage. Eh. Do I want storm witches at this point? I guess I still have some. Also, there's still no way of transferring money from one character to another. Even Grim Dawn has that. You can buy bars of iron or, or whatever the hell. Farewell. Put them in the stash and then convert them back to just regular iron. Oh yeah, this game is still behind Grim Dawn. <laughs> With mechanics and stuff like that, but hey, it's fun still. And somehow it's faster than Grimdown. With the uh, fast speed, or very fast speed. Normal speed is still slow as well. Oh, 
Oh god damn it, they have a horn attack! Did they always have that or is that one of the changes? A lot of like mummies and like Egyptian sounding enemies got changed and balanced and certain enemies got new skills and stuff. I don't know if the centaurs got anything new, but I don't remember their horn. But I guess now they are horny, so... I mean, they got the horse cocks to, you know, go with it. Disgusting. Hello up there. Hello. Yeah, I got fucked, boar. <laughs> I can stun them. So if they do the cheeky with their banners, I can just be like, nope. And they just stand there all stunned and stuff. Very nice. Stealth spiders. Lightning literally didn't do jack. Poor guy. I just didn't care about his lightning attacks. It was like gentle sunshine caressing my cheeks on a spring morning. Ah, oh, how lovely. It would be cool if I could buff enemies, you know. Just for the fun of it. I don't know why they got aggroed, but maybe they heard the voices and the noises of death and combat and they were like, let's check it out. Yeah, some shower in microwaves. Not this soon. 
How many times did I die with this? Seven times! That was just normal difficulty. Normal difficulty. Imagine dying on normal difficulty. Imagine dying seven times on normal difficulty. I did that. Come back here, you rascals. Ah! is close again. Slap a save on top. Is the Hydra legendary yet? Or epic? I wonder. I don't remember when the thing spawns. But I'm close to its location, so I guess. I guess we'll find out. I'm gonna level up first, though. Give me my sweet, sweet bonus damage for something I don't use. Not often though. Anyways. Maybe you should increase the base level. So this thing lasts longer, yeah. It gets like six seconds per level up. It's pretty good. And the recharge doesn't go higher either, so. Hmm. Maybe you should level it up a couple. Oh wow. Pulls out the banner and then the stun immediately. Forty four. Ah. 47 second duration. That's not bad. Not bad at all. Gotta go with that avoid projectile stuff. I'm gonna max that out. At least till uh, soft cap. Because I like the idea of not being bothered too much about the uh, Baidu's um, skeleton. Object throwers. There's a big flame spear man. He's dead. I popped everything I had and he's dead now. At least I think I popped everything. I don't know if I successfully did the W. was that stun? Jesus! I just stood there. What's my stun resi, if any? 25%. And, it, and we're still like there for like a couple of seconds. And this is on very fast, so th those couple of seconds were longer. Holy crap. 
Hold on there. Whatever no. you do. Whatever you do. We sent the scout. Don't go in there. Dead. You, you, you. A problem, sir. Happy to help. I live to serve. My own needs. Aha! And that is more money. Ooh! It's Defiler! I think I had this. Why is it dropping me... garbage? <laughs> Simply put, why is it dropping me stuff that is... way below my level? I mean, come on. Did they screw up the drop tables or something? I hope not. Action music. I might hate that. Need some stun resistance. More. You dare come here. This camp. Stab the air, yeah. Okay, so the thing is on legendary, not, not epic. That's okay. Could have like a baby version or something. Because the fact that the, all these legendary monsters only come out on legendary, like. People have to play all the way to that. Hey, you there! If you see our troop. Drink some more water. My body's shutting down from dehydration. I don't know. Blah. Glug glug. Oh, that actually felt good. I think I needed some water. <laughs> Remember, people, hydrate. Still yawning. I guess that wasn't the the issue. 
maybe I'm just... Maybe I'm just tired. Stunned. Skeleton. Oh, my fire resistance is garbage. <laughs> Minus ten percent. Character is so straightforward. Just go in and stab. Stop running away, you're like on no health. Unbelievable. Oh, and I got sniped. Oh god. I'm dead. I'm so dead. I must run! No! Thundercrab, save me! I desperately need some stun resistance, or I have to bait those guys. I gotta jailbait those guys, yeah. I don't need any horse gang rape or something like that. Like I got stunned, I got netted. They were all encircling the character too. So. That was not good. Death didn't happen, so that's nice. Not that there is any big penalty for that. Mostly they're running back to the place of the death. But that's about it. Experience comes back easy. Look at these archers! Damn, that projectile avoid percentage. I, I need that. That's my projectile avoidance now. 27%. Yeah, that definitely wasn't in the game before. Like, it, it didn't just show it. Ah. That feels nice. Just look at that and boom, there, there it is. You don't have to go through all your items and then your skills and add them up manually. It's just there. And that I really like. More of that kind of updates, please. Up. 
I think uh, monsters also got a different, uh, like enemy monsters, not pets and summons, but enemies got different, uh, what's that called, resistance bonuses, I think they get 50 and 100% on epic and legendary respectively. I think there, so there was some kind of like 200% increase in some resistances for like bosses and such. It's like, but how do they, how do you hurt them? Do they just heal from everything? So what if someone is pure fire? And they meet uh, an enemy with like 200% fire resistance and and there are no way to apply fire debuff, or fire resistance debuff. What will that character do? Just die? Alright you, you pissed in my soup for the last time. Although this guy will come back at least once more on legendary difficulty, but still. Banned. Oh look, it's another Vest of Ericura. Another goddamn piece of shit I can't pick up. Oh well. What is this lag? Stream is doing well though. And before I jinxed it, god damn it, read your fucking thing. You there. There you go. I think that was the healer preset of the elders, but still. Feels good to just destroy them without them doing any of their skills and stuff. Damage numbers.
Damn, fire archers. Now they destroy me. Pierce, fire, physical damage. Yeah. Kind of bad on all fronts of right now. But that will change one day. Oh god, what is that? It's like a hero. Long stride. It's dead now. Sounds like a Warcraft character. Sergos Longstride. Obviously a Minotaur dude for on the horde side. Or a cowman. Whatever they are. Cow people. Does Warcraft have centaurs? I wouldn't know. But if they do, there's definitely a long stride. No! Ah! Your fucking doom horn! Piece of shit! There, stun you back. Out of spite. There's another one. Oh, it's the healer guy. Oh, for fuck's sake. These boars out of here. Yeah, that's another healer. Athens. It's within spitting distance. It's amazing. This this guy is excited. To Athens. I was a fool. I was a fool. Look at all them component parts. I beg of you, please. Hey, Don't warrior. care. I have the finest goods in Athens. You will find none better. Wait, what was that? Life leech percentage. 8% attack damage converted to health. That's nice. 
And some vitality damage. I could use this. My pet would lose a lot of damage bonus and attack damage converted to health, but I kind of need that attack damage converted to health. The cold would go down to 62%. Guess I'll see how substantial that 7% or whatever it 8% is. If it's not that big of a deal, I can switch back, so I'm gonna keep this for now. Oh, orange. Do I have orange? I have gold. Athena guard you. Sure. Do you guys have better well health met. potions? Grand still? Farewell! Once I sell everything I've got. I'm setting sail for some island that's never seen a monster. Goodbye then. There's no such thing. By Hermes and Isis both. Welcome. Isis. You can't say that. Garbage ass defiler. What is this? Dark core. Okay, and I have. I need the greater score of ventures. I can get that. This guy sells those. Hello again. Right there. Anything else? Let's make a dark core. What else do I need from my stage? A caravan is what you need, eh? I need the epic rigid carapace. Is that? <laughs> There's a rigid carapace. Do I have one in here? Oh, I do. Okay, so these are all the same. Let's take this one. And then we take. Uh, do I have a dark core in here, by the way? No. Okay, so this is something new. And an embodiment of Zeus's thunderbolt right there. Some ch stun chance. Do I have one in here? Nope. So that's the only. That's the only one. So long then. Where's the uh, the dude? The dude that does. And the what thing. can I do for you? For you. Wow! It's like like a dissection of an of a, of a peach or something. You're sure you're finished. An apricot. The thing looks tasty, not gonna lie. Looks looks tasty. Dark core. Pierce damage, lightning damage, flat lightning damage, pierce resistance, intelligence percentage, and energy percentage. That's kind of interesting. It gives you pierce damage, but also intelligence. Like pierce the pierce damage doesn't really fit in this picture. It gives even more pierce resistance. Wow, 56% altogether. That's pretty nice. But. Oh, that one, the Shadow of Eternal Night is like energy leech. There it is. I glossed over that. Man, my vitality damage resist would go down to absolute shit. Ugh. I lose damage, but look at that, look at that 44% pierce resistance, I kinda want that. So the attack speed goes down, but the average damage as well goes down, so it's not just the attack speed that gives damage. So yeah, the flat physical damage, the extra poison damage. Better than the lightning, I guess. It's interesting. Oh, it also gives flat piercing damage. Yeah, there it goes. 
But Dark Core has percentage pierce damage, so in the long run that should be better. I guess. Although this 10 fat piercing damage on the Eternal Knight benefits from the bonuses as well. I want that pierce resistance. So a yeah, Shroud of Eternal Night that has been in the possession of most of my characters is going back. What can I hold? Going back into the, the vault. So someone else can use it one day. Let's see what, what other things I have here. Wow, this would give a lot of damage. Holy crap. 13% physical damage, vitality damage, life leech, 9% attack damage converted to health, Vit flat vitality damage and bonus damage complete. Okay, I, that screwed this peach seed thing. That's, I don't need that. Shit. <laughs> I don't care about peace resistance anymore. Look at that. Another 9% life leech. And I got this. Look at that. Look at that. 17 percent that's pretty good in my opinion what else do I have this is garbage garbage no they need damage necromancy sleep duration dream mastery yeah, that's not for me there's a fury of the ages Soul Shiver is pretty strong, yeah. Even into Legendary. I can see that, that 9% and the nice uh, physical and vitality uh, percentage. I can see why it's pretty strong. I'm going to use it. And these I can't use because I need half more level. Alright, what else can I craft? Anything. Thunderfist! Oh. Nothing else, alright. I guess now I don't really need to keep this sort of uh, necklace, I can put this back. To have my cold maxed out as well. Then again, I can put something that's cold resistant on this thing, because it's a green, right? So... If I have something that's cold resi... You know what I, addition I would also love to see? I got them search bar in the stash. Because I don't know what these do. <laughs> if you do lots of damage and add more damage to health items, you're extremely tanky. Hell yeah. Unless you get one shot. Any cold resi? Then again, why would I need cold resi? I should top up. I'll shore up the other defenses instead of something that's already in 62%, so I don't know why I'm looking for cold resistance, specifically. I would like to have some vitality resistance, or bleed or something. Chance to avoid projectiles. All shields. All shields, you say? All of them? Goodbye. I really hope you're not lying to me, all shields. Piece of shit! Well, another overburdened warrior. <laughs> I hate this game. <laughs> All shields except blues and purples. Haha. <laughs> Suck my dick. But I leveled up though, so I can look at these shields. Let's see. Deimos. That. Basically, all of these are new. So. Plus one to all skills? Ooh, I'm listening. 53% damage, more damage blocked. Okay, Pierce Resistance, I like where this is heading. Elemental Resistance, there we go. Poison Resistance, I don't need that. Block Chance, even more. Physical Damage, oh yes. Life Leech Retaliation, oh my god. Offensive Ability, I love the shield already. At like 25% damage to health, you're very much unkillable in vanilla. Really? Ooh, I'm close to that. Deimos isn't good. Don't you talk to Deimos like that. <laughs> Don't you tell me 
it's not good. It's definitely good. But there's probably something better in this group already, so let me just look through them, alright? Jesus. 36% bleed resi. Ooh, I would I would be in a world of hurt without that. Minus 40%! Oh my god, and I need strained. Fucking shit. Energy reach resi, I don't care about fire resi. It's good as well. There's the 4% book chance. The shitty damage reflect. Oh, 12% chance to avoid projectiles and the attributes, yeah. Since I really need those attributes, I can't really... I mean... Damn, I would have to spend 7 more attribute points. Just to get back there. Plus one to all skills is not bad, and the offensive ability, the damage, the resistances it gives, the block chance... Basically everything is good on it, and it's a set item as well. But... Two of my resistance, elemental resistances are already high. I just got a bunch of life leech, so that life leech retaliation is not that important. My offensive ability is not bad. Eh, it could be better. I like that physical damage and the more block chance, but I need those attributes, man. So without the uh, strange shield, I can equip these four. Scale of the Black Dragon is something I couldn't, so we'll look at that separately. So Deimos is not bad, contrary to popular belief. Deimos is better than the one I have. I beg to differ. <laughs> I need this one. Projectile Avoid. Stats. Bleed Resi. Fire Resi. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I feel like we are disagreeing on that one. But I have like five more shields to go through, so let's see. Something I can't pronounce. 49%. So better block, better damage blocked. Lightning Resi, I don't care. Vitality damage resi, that would be amazing. Energy leech resi, I don't care, there's an extra 4% as well. Physical damage again. Stats! The only thing I lose here is the 12% chance to avoid projectiles, which is shit to lose, but... And also the bleed resi, and the fire. And I don't care about the lightning, yeah, this, this can go fuck itself. What would be the extra damage? Son of a bitch. But still have to spend one point. I've gained some damage. But I'm already good damage wise. It looks kinda cool and kinda ugly at the same time. Like something is corrupting it. Look at that. Some kind of Warframe shield, you know, shield with the infestation or whatever the fuck on it. Like growing corns and shit. Disgusting. Um, what about the bullshit? Bullshit 53, okay. Armor protection, oh my. Pierce resistance, bleeding resistance. I'm listening. 21% extra physical damage. More stun duration. I hope that applies to Thunderclap. Chance of stun, 15% chance. A bunch of decks, health and some defensive ability. I would lose the strain though. I'd have to spend the 7 points for my armor, but but I like this so far. Piercing gets fixed mostly. Bleed comes to positive. Fire falls. That's okay. I get a bunch of health. Like, almost 400 extra health. I like this shit so far. Taurus shield. Yes, yes, yes. The Greg. <laughs> Here's Greg. A little worse blocking. A bunch of health. Holy shit. And regions. Defensive ability. Dodge. How does it look? What is this? An Oreo? 
<laughs> That's a fucking Oreo, dude. <laughs> That's hilarious. I love that. I thought it was some kind of like wooden shield or something. It's a fucking biscuit. <laughs> I'm not gonna use it, but that's that's hilarious. That the Greg. <laughs> okay, I like that one. Hector, Hector's shimmering shield, same block and damage blocked. Pierce resistance worse. Cold resistance, stun resistance. Eighteen percent chance to fumble attacks. What to me or to the enemy? I hope it's not to my character. Strength and Dexterity, okay. A lot of health. Defensive and offensive ability. Ooh, I like this too. I would lose the damage though. But I wouldn't need to spend attribute points. Minus 40% bleed? Oh, I don't want to go there. I don't want to go to absolute no bleed resistance. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah, and even less damage than what I have right now. I like that health bonus. But it's basically the same as here. Yeah, that sucks. And then there's the scale of the Black Dragon. Pierce resistance, fire resistance, okay. Would lose the bleed resistance. A lot of health, strained. Ring of flame, oh gross. Get out of here. How does it look though? Oh my god! It's ugly. But I think I'm gonna use the Crest of Taurus. Yeah. That looks okay. And I have need for fire and vitality resistance. Yeah. Got some extra life, armor, more blocking, damage. I lost strength, gained one dex. Yeah. Sure. Taurus shield to the rescue. So I mean, we are in Greece. I keep good at your service. Do I have any cool items I can use? They're like good. Chicken feet. Dream master. Oh my god, more strain stacking. Oof. I lose dexterity though, I don't want to lose dexterity. I don't want to lose even more defensive ability and stuff. I had like 890 something and I'm down to like 759. Like, shit. Oh wait, no, I didn't have 890. I had 800 and something. But still. Holy crap! Plus 80% life leech? Does that work with my 17? Will it double my life leech? How does that even work? So there's the life leech bonus. It goes to 110%. So, I have this 17 plus 110% on top of that. Oh no, wait, life leech and uh, damage converted to health is different, right? I think it's different. Almost all pets. Amulet of Hygiene. I mean, Amulet of Hygiene is pretty good. A little bit of everything. 
but I want to keep that health thingy. Then again, I got the Soul Shiver, and I can chug potions. I might put on the Amulet of, Amulet of Hygiene. Even more armor protection. Oh! Even though jewelry and the bonus exists, it doesn't count because it's not a flat number, it's a percentage. It doesn't show anywhere else. Here's bleed, elemental, poison. Poison I don't really care about, but the rest. Yeah. Yeah. That's fine. I'll keep this ambulance. Keep this too. It's nice. I have another amulet of hygiene. Let's see the numbers. Better, 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 better. I don't care about poison. 1% less. Energy leech I don't care about. Stun disease worse. Skill disruption. Yeah, this is better. Yes! Beautiful! Very nice. All these ugly ass things. Oh my god! Five hundred and sixty-five. Can't believe the heights of strength we can go to. All right, that's okay. I am satisfied. I am satisfied with my changes. And I'm not using Deimos there. Everyone can calm down. <laughs> Honestly, they are all good. They all they all look good shields, but it depends on what what I need and what I have. So. I feel like this Taurus one is the one I like the most, and it also has its own stun. Like it's a it's a. Single target stun still. Ah! I want to pick that shield up. But I can't! That's not a shield. What the fuck? It's an actual tower shield! And it's tiny! <laughs> I was expecting a goddamn, like, those Roman shields, you know, those big red tower shields. This is a tower shield for Greeks? Piece of shit. Get the fuck out of here. Wah. Look, she's also having a Taurus shield. Nice, we're all Taurus shield. Enjoyers. Very nice. But mine is the actual Taurus shield. These are all just cheap replicas. They do nothing. Just garbage items. Necklace of Foreskin. That's TOS. So I'm not even going to look at what it does. I'm just gonna sell it. Ooh. Where am I going? <laughs> <laughs> I was just going down there, thinking that's the way forward. <laughs> it's adorable. I never noticed that thing before. The tiny angel looking dude. Just 
stab. Sadly, I think, though, that uh, there are no more higher level items that this character can inherit. I think these unique legendary shields were the only ones I had in the possession of my uh, summoner. And I think the, uh, like the chest armor is also like one of the ones that are... High level and relevant to this character. From now on, what I find is what I get. No more hand me downs and things stashed away. Like, there's that one more, and Booty's whatever the crack. Booty's advocate. Or damage increase, but that's about it. But I feel like I'm in a good position right now. I can upgrade my helmet. Actually, my helmet is already upgraded. God damn. Oh, with more percentages. Nice. So I cannot upgrade anything anymore because I switched this to a purple. Dang it. But this is pretty good. <gasps> Ooh! Is this a stacker? Oh my god, another strength and health stacker. Nice. One day. One day the stacking will happen. But I might not be around for it. Meh. To stack. All the strength, all the health, and nothing else. Glorious day. Where all the attribute points were going to strength. Nothing else. It's gonna be a warfare plus defensive mastery character. Actually, warfare and dream. Because dream gives more strength than defensive mastery. Hmm. Although I wouldn't get dexterity from defensive mastery, it would be intelligence. That's not giving defensive uh, mastery or defensive uh, ability, what it's called? Ability, yeah. So. So it would have to be defense and uh, warfare. So it wouldn't be all the strange I could get, but. It would probably be a very boring character, but <laughs> who knows? It's a loop. I need it. For the loops. I honestly don't even remember where I'm going now. What are, what are these catacombs for? 
I completely forgot what I'm doing here. It's only been like a month and a half maybe since I last played this game. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> like I'm familiar with the place but I don't know what comes next. <laughs> Is this before we sail to the Cow Island? I feel like that's what this is, but... but I'm not sure. Suppose I could look at my quest log. Oh, the Spartans lost! Oh my god. Oh, I keep forgetting about that goddamn quest. Parnassus? Athens? Oh, what? I think it's Athens that's closer. I'm gonna have to run around either way. Maybe I should wait with that until I am. On the Bull Island. Because then I don't have to run or teleport back here. Crest of Cloud. <laughs> How deep is the ship? Okay, I see something on the map. A lost star, Scourge of Archeon. Okay. I don't remember this dude. Is this the undead guy? Is that what's happening here? Is he vitality damage? <laughs> he probably is. Maybe elemental or something. Ooh, all the loot from these corpse boxes. Yeah. Hello! My dude didn't come in. Oh, he's getting destroyed. Jesus. <laughs> Aww. I think we reached our mark. Three and a half hours. Wait, we're over our mark. Jesus Christ. Although half an hour I did nothing for half an hour, so I guess we are at three hours of gameplay almost. Mysterious warrior. By saving my life, you have done more than you know. I lead the Order of Prometheus in Athens. We are an ancient order, charged with the safekeeping of the mortal realm. What you have heard is true. The force behind these monsters is a powerful being, a lesser titan known as a Telkin. The titans are an ancient race of gods, much older than Zeus and his brethren. They once had absolute power. All creatures followed their rule. Eventually, the gods created humans and gifted us with intelligence. We defied the Titans on many occasions, and they were determined to destroy us. 
The gods resisted, refusing to let their greatest creation be destroyed, and a great war ensued. So happy. It seemed as though the titans would triumph. However, oh. a few bold warriors and heroes aided the gods. They banished the titans to a nether realm. We he goes believed back. that all the Telkins were banished with them. It seems we were wrong. The Telkin is now bound for Nossos <laughs> on the Isle of Crete. We, we fear that he plans to destroy a sacred artifact which we have guarded for ages. This artifact keeps us in contact with the godly realm. If it is destroyed, there's no telling what will happen. You have to stop him. Go to the docks here in Athens. You will find an agent of our order who will arrange your passage to Crete. Hurry. The fate of the world is in your hands. This guy looks like he's a gilded eggplant or something. We We did it! We can go to the bull island. Oh! Machine gun dog! He's back. Keeping that estate safe. Safe from all the snake people. Snake people! Sexy, sexy snake people! Oh yeah, we all know what happens in XCOM 2. Snake people. <laughs> they just tightly wrap around you. Phaedrus, this boat is a... This is a boat, thank you. <laughs> if only there was a game where you can drive the boat. This look like seeds, what the fuck? They're not boats. These very deceptive seeds. Welcome, string. Welcome, string. What? And now the run back begins. Run back to... Right there. Yeah, it's, it's pretty close by, I guess. I could engage some speed hacks, give the game another 500% speed increase and just go meow. But hey, I'm not gonna do that. We're going to enjoy the corpses and the burning scenery. Not be spared. Oh, that's a lance. Thought that said little aspis. <laughs> Just a little. <laughs> Bond. No one shall be spared. You were in the swamp. Done. Caravan storage! Mm -hmm. Not a lot of things I got. 15%. 14, 7. 15, 7. And this needs more strength than this, but this is better. Get out of here, you garbage. Look at this. Level 15, 256. Level 15, 240. It gives more armor, more strength, and the same health. Wow. Upgrade! To something I don't intend to use for a while. Let's still upgrade. Oh! 
All right. Uh, my shop is a shadow of its former glory. We've fallen on hard times here. Still, perhaps I can help you. So grand. I'm getting these fat ones from quests and stuff, but still just grand. <laughs> So long. The beasts have claws and teeth, but you have fire. You have Zeus-like bolts to throw. Bye now. How can I help you? Good luck. Good luck indeed. I feel like I should stop here, but... I also feel like listening to this album again, so... <laughs> the game crashed. I guess that's a sign, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I guess then this is the where where I stop. Three hours, thirty minutes, boom, done. Yeah, uh, cool, cool beans, cool beans. So I'll, if things don't explode in my laptop, then I, I'll, I guess I'll pick this up tomorrow. I'll run through epic difficulty with this bone charmer. I'm not gonna restart the game now. It crashed. I mean, actually, I am going to restart it because I, I want to... Like, or put some... You know, order my, my stash, or... Sort my stash, that's the word, not order. I'm not gonna order my stash to anything. I'm gonna sort it. Before the light of the gods entered the... Shut up! <laughs> I have to, like, click a lot of times to skip that thing. So yeah, um, stabby character, pretty good. I have like a shield. Oh my god, the game is gonna crash again, isn't it? It froze. Oh, it crashed again. Okay, they must have introduced some kind of bullshit. I will have to uh, validate the files and do some integrity checking, I guess. But anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. See you tomorrow, maybe. But for now, goodbye.